So let's see about the availability sets. So availability sets are the way for you to ensure your application remains online if high impacted maintenance is required or a hardware failure occurs. So this is like uh, uh, obviously when you are going for any sort of infrastructure you have a lot of maintenance activities you have to do right like when you are going for a software you will have a, a patching or any sort of upgradation or any uh, security upgrades that you have to done like if there is any failure of hardware then you need to replace all those right so like this availability sets are designed for those okay so azure i mean make sure that the vms you placed in availability sets run across a multiple physical servers computer racks storage units and network switches so if a, if there is any sort of hardware or a software failure happens only a subsequent of your vms are impacted and your overall solution stays operational so this is like a, a keeping a multiple copies of your resource so whenever there is a failure of any sort of hardware or software obviously it is going to get the details from other like if there is any db failure db instance failure then it is going to get from a slave or it is going to get from the read replica of other databases or if there is any sort of uh, uh, upgradation going on one server then instead of going to instead of drive, diverting traffic to that particular instance it is going to uh, divert to another instance which is of same type so this is like creating a multiple copies of your resource okay and how they are going to achieve they have a two models there one is updated domains and other is a fault domains okay i'm going to discuss them in a next video